Now we talked about drop your foot back and you go back and you're gonna go like this. Your foot's gonna turn in so your knee is behind your, so this knee with that staggered stance, you're gonna turn this in and down where that knee stays behind this one, just like that. Oh, perfect. Good. So you start to feel how that femur rotates down and in. Right. Or how your foot is rotating. So there's yeah, a difference. It feels like my foot's doing that in the ground. Yeah, see, it was interesting. I think a reason that I was pretty good at this is because in baseball, when I was a kid, they used to teach you get here and they teach you to what they called squish the bug. Now they don't do as much of that anymore, but this foot worked like this. So what did this knee do? See, it worked down and in this way. So when I came to golf, my leg, this just did that. I never had, I, I mean, that's something I never even struggled mm -hmm. with was my hips going out. It was because I spent so much time making that. So this, this leg rotated down and in this way automatically. So it was never, for me, luckily, it was never an issue. We, I sit here looking, everybody over there, they get here and the first move they make is this knee goes like that. I don't see anybody where this leg works down and in where this does that. They all go here. And once that goes out and up, we're limited as to what you can do. Sure. Okay, do it again. So drop that foot back. And now we're gonna go back and rotate that foot down and in where that knee actually gets behind your left. Yeah, so for me, Mike, I need to feel like this, this hip socket, it feels like it goes back and stays there and it's not this that's working, but it's my leg that's working, it's my foot that's working. Yeah. So it's your, it's your femur that, that rotates in your hip socket and it rotates because of what your foot's doing. Yeah. So your feet are, your foot's actually twisting mm -hmm. in the ground, not just pushing. And it's you can actually, feel that spike that you always talk yeah. about. Yeah, and that's what, you know, the baseball players mm -hmm. talk about that second spike in their right foot, turning that spike turning it down and then twisting it into the ground that keeps their right hip from going out. Good. Good. Now let's do that and let's watch, let's take a video here and let's see what your hips do when you do that. There you go. Keep it going down. Good. Now just that little, come and watch this. Okay. Now your right hip is starting to work down. So your hips keep going. So even that, your hips are tilted a little bit, not as much as they should, but that's pretty good. Right. Because now your right hip didn't work up. So your body keeps rotating. So because your body keeps rotating, there's not as much rotation in the club face. Anytime your body stops, then the club's gonna overtake it. It's hard to keep the face from, from turning down. So that's, that's a really good drill. So now we've got that now we're just gonna we've got your impact position which you're really good at and you can you can program that and now we've got that foot drop back where you feel how that foot's rotating into the ground mm -hmm. thank you for watching this video i know it's going to help your game remember to comment on the videos like subscribe and turn on notifications to watch for new Malaska golf videos coming your way